are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the afternoon edition. This is for Thursday, the 5th of November. Alabama's weather quiet through the weekend, but all eyes are on Ada. This thing headed for the Gulf of Mexico next week. Here we go. This is the upper air look across the country today. Got a little weak uh, shortwave trough west of the state producing some high cirrus clouds across the region. There's the visible satellite view, but those are clouds up at about 25,000 feet, not rain producing clouds. And we're dry, and we think we stay dry through at least Sunday. Temperatures right where they should be for early November, right around 70 in most spots. Birmingham at 70 at 2.30. There's the watch warning map, another quiet day across the country. There's the severe weather outlook today, tomorrow. And on Saturday, we note the green up into South Alabama. There might be a few isolated showers for the southern quarter of the state, but again, most locations we think will be dry. Rain for the next seven days. Alabama's weather not too wet, if this verifies. This is the rain valid through Thursday morning of next week. The big numbers over parts of South Florida with Ada. And then you can see the numbers increasing over the Gulf. And at some point, we could see a pretty big bump in rain chances with the tropical system. But again, there is much, much uncertainty. Uh, Ada is currently a tropical depression that is inland over Honduras. Uh, very disorganized. However, the center comes out across the water, becomes a tropical storm again by Saturday morning, moves across Cuba on Sunday, and then takes a hard left and it's uh, located west of Key West early Tuesday morning, if this verifies. And again, we stress until this thing gets back over the water, it's going to be hard to draw these forecast cones. This is the tropical model set at 18Z. A couple of outliers, but the tropical models have shifted back to the west, uh, showing the system mostly in the Gulf in five days. And this is the reliable European ensemble. And almost all the members, and there's 50 of them, uh, place this thing in the Gulf of Mexico. So Ada could very well be a big player in Alabama's weather toward the end of next week, about eight, nine days from now. This is the intensity guidance. Most models keep this thing as a tropical storm. Let's look at the GFS. This is the 12Z run, valid tomorrow at 4. Got an upper low that's on the Texas-Louisiana coast, otherwise ridging across the eastern part of the country. And for us, the day will be partly sunny with highs in the low to mid-70s, much like today. Saturday, we're dry, mid-70s, partially sunny. Maybe a few showers near the coast. This is Sunday, a dry day. Uh, we might be close to 80 on Sunday. And uh, Ada is on the north coast of Cuba, if this verifies. And then Monday, it takes that left turn. Ada is just to the west of Key West. We're dry. Highs probably 77 to 80. Tuesday, we might mention a slight chance of a shower, but again, I think we'll be dry. Ada is in the southern Gulf. Wednesday, moisture increases a bit. We'll mention a chance of showers, mostly cloudy. Ada in the Gulf, and this is a week from today. Big trough in the west, ridging on the east coast. And Ada is moving northward. Up toward the central Gulf Coast is a weak tropical system. And again, if this verifies, there could be a few scattered showers Thursday, but probably nothing too widespread. This is the European at the same time, Thursday of next week, and it voids right in sync with the GFS. It's got uh, Ada a bit stronger, under 1,000 millibars, uh, due south of Mobile. And again, uh, a chance of showers here. So let's go to the GFS Friday night of next week. This is Friday night, November 13th, and it's got uh, Ada is a weak tropical system coming up into Pensacola and Navarre Beach. And obviously, if that's the case, it could be pretty wet toward the end of next week. And then we'll go out 10 days. This is Sunday the 15th. Again, big trough in the west. That's pushing Ada northward through Alabama. But remember, this is out in the land of voodoo, and this can and probably will change for sure. Rain for Birmingham, no doubt. Uh, rain chances increasing in about 10 to, uh, I'm sorry, 8 to 15 days. The mean is up to about 2 inches on the uh, European ensemble. Temperatures highs will be in the 70s for a while. Morning's pretty... Uh, Mild with lows in the 60s much of next week. And then we start to cool down towards Sunday the 15th after Ada passes through. 
And the CPC outlook just in November 13th through the 19th. And again, we're in the red. That means temperature should be above average. The weather noticeably colder out west if this verifies. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this afternoon. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. You can catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great evening and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.